Okay, so I'm going to talk to you about, this is quite a big one, and this is what mostly makes people feel a little bit uncomfortable. But my divorce life coaching is about asking you to look at the things and make bolder choices about how you think and how you see uh, what is going on and what is happening. Acceptance and letting go versus resignation and holding on. So think of people that you know who've had things happen to them in life. They may have fallen out with family members. They may have fallen out with friends. They may have got divorced. And you start hearing them talk about, um, this person did this to me and I'm, you know, and you can feel the, uh, the anger. You can feel the pain still. And you really, really, you know, you really wish, especially if you care about them a lot, that they didn't have to feel like this. And acceptance and letting go versus resignation and holding on is all about forgiveness and forgetting. Now, I work a lot with people on forgiving what the person um, for what they did to them. And this is the thing that makes people raise their eyebrows. So they just go, no, I'm never going to do that. Okay, and you have a choice as with everything as to whether you want that to happen. So forgiveness is actually the emotional part. It's the emotional part that we see in these people that are still holding on to this stuff, these emotions, years and years on. And emotions are the heavy baggage that people drag around with them forever. So when I work with clients, we do a lot of work on forgiveness and it's a really big ask. But with anything in life, if you want to feel better, if you want to move on, um, we have to do difficult work and but that's where the real magic in life happens because it breaks open and allows good stuff to come in or you can just stay feeling really angry and you can feel really heartbroken still and you know it's not taking anything away from what has happened to you but it helps you live uh, uh, a more gentler, more emotional, baggage-free life moving forwards. So what I do is we work on forgiveness and actually you don't have to forget what happened to you. So I'm not asking you to get rid of everything, but I actually in the not forgetting, you're using what has happened to you as a, um, a lesson, a life lesson. So it's working on that experience. It's learning from that experience. It's growing stronger for, and using that experience to help you feel, yeah, to help you feel stronger and to be able to move on. So acceptance and letting go versus resignation and holding on. I know which one I prefer to uh, have taken forward with me. Um, and my question is, uh, do you know which one you would prefer? Thank you for listening.